I'm Matt Cerrone from MetsBlog.com and SNY.TV. Today's the first inter-squad game, so you've got Sandy Alomar Jr. managing one side and Sandy Alomar Sr. managing the other. So let's check out the action. So on the mound here is uh, Dylan Gee, one of their uh, young minor league pitchers. Uh, has a lot of hype behind him, and he's pitching to Luis Castillo. So here's really our first uh, shot at seeing uh, Castillo in the batter's box. Note he's hitting leadoff uh, for the first time this offseason. Here we have John Neese pitching to Ramon Martinez, who I guess is fighting for a bench spot, though. I think it's a long shot he makes the team. You notice Jerry Manuel's uh, vantage point for the game basically is the roamer position in softball where he just sort of hangs out, leans on his bat, watches the whole game right there behind second. The first hit of the season, I, I guess you can call it that, was uh, given up by Nelson Figueroa to Nick Evans of all people. At the plate is Alex Cora. So your first look at uh, the backup infielder, though I think he came on board with the idea that he might end up being the starting second baseman, depending on how Castillo does. Here's our first look at Carlos Beltran of the spring. Looks like he's arguing balls and strikes. So here's a flip-flop for a scenario. You've got Castillo at first, Reyes at the plate. Robert Parnell is on the mound, and I'm curious if we see the split finger fastball we learned a little bit about the other day. Hope you enjoyed the highlights from the inter squad game. I'm going to take a quick break and then try and track down Jose Valentin for a quick interview.